and today is the big day part 21 of my SharePoint intranet series we're going to be looking at how we can launch our intranet we've done all those steps we've got some stuff together and I'm quite excited to launch this intranet so of course I'm going to go to PowerPoint so I'm going to go screen recording that's going to go back to my intranet so that's why I use alt tab to see which screen it toggles to so there we go um, welcome to the new nerve center and uh, we are so happy to launch this new intranet with you and we just want to take you through a couple of pointers to help you find your way at the top there you'll see the global navigation this is where you can very easily access uh, all the things that are uh, applicable to you as an employee this is where you can find a link to all the departments and um, this is uh, where you'll find various types of documents that you might need in the intranet and um, when you look at the landing page of course we're going to take you to various pages as well this is where you'll see the news feed we've brought in the twitter feed as well to help you learn there's the main documents that you work with this is the same documents as what you see up there there's uh, policies and there's some faqs there's our microsoft stream with which we're going to publish some videos to you any videos that are relevant and that we think uh, you might find interesting we've brought in yammer for you as well and uh, there's our, our new event remember this is the launch on monday so you can go and click on add to my calendar it will remind you to come to the launch event you'll always see page contacts on the pages so this is the person that you can contact if you have any questions and then on most of the pages we've added a survey at the bottom but we've also added the results so you can see what other people are saying we would love your feedback because that's the only way that we can make this a really really amazing intranet so please uh, take the time to just uh, have a scroll through and familiarize yourself remember that you can search the site so right at the top there i can search and remember to use those boolean operators so space minus and space plus so we can go policy space minus leave plus cell or something if it's something specific that you're looking for so remember there's a page for all the departments as well that just tells you more about the departments and what it is that they do but uh, we hope that you'll love this intranet and please give us feedback In Microsoft Stream, I'm going to load that video in the applicable channel where I want to surface it through. So I've got training videos, 365, but there you'll see we've got the nerve center, right? You can add descriptions and things there and do some settings on it. Permissions as well. This obviously has been set as company-wide, so I know that everyone will be able to see it. And then, of course, as soon as it's loaded, we're going to just publish it. And there we go. There's my new video, so I'm going to grab the URL to this video so that I can share it with uh, with other people. And you'll see that sharing is there at the bottom. I'm going to just grab that uh, that URL there, and I'm going to go back to my SharePoint site. Now, what I've done in the background is I've started with a news feed article. So there we go, the new um, and this is a news feed from my front landing page. Of course, this is by going from there. I'm going to say, "How's it, guys?" Um, we are uh, launching a new intranet, so this is where I want to go and add the stream web part. Single video, there we go. And then on this side, of course, I'm going to go put some important text in there. And, uh, and there's my very cool little video. It's so exciting. So there we go. Nerve Center is launched. If I go to that article, I just want to show you that I can, from this article, I'm going to go send by mail. And I can promote it as well. So for now, I'm going to just send it to Brown because I'd like to show you what this looks like. And of course, you can have a little message there as well. Um, man, I'm being so lazy. But there can be a cute little message saying, hey, guys, we'd love you to go and check out the new intranet. Please click on this link to learn more. And there we go. There's uh, my little email that I've gotten to say, hey, the nerve center is launched. I've got a bit of a write up there and I've got a link that people can click. So if they click the link, it's going to obviously open that news feed article or that news page, which means I've brought them right to the nerve center. And um, of course, I can put a little note in here to say um, at the top of the page, just click on home and uh, explore the rest of the site or something. So that'll definitely help them to just uh, navigate a bit better. And there's my little video that I've made and the email is sent and of course other things you can do is do posters you can do little stand-up um, auditorium sessions or what they call brown bag sessions in lunch times and uh, i'm pretty sure you're going to love your internet and your users are going to love your internet so good luck with that and uh, i'll catch you up in the next series